The larger-than-life lion is a relic of Cincinnati's brewing history. Leo the lion was brought over from Germany to be displayed in front of the Windisch Mulhauser Brewing Company. When the brewery closed and a new one moved in, Dan Doran says that's when he was told his family came into the story. They moved a lot of the machinery in the, into and out of the breweries and um, they, they started out in the trucking business and they moved a lot of stuff off the, the, the river. Visitors can see Leo the lion perched in front of the Mulhauser barn at Beckett Park. But over at Green Township, he has a sister named Leona. She looks exactly like her brother and is painted. I'm really proud of it. I really am. I think it's cool and I'm glad to see that Leo is still going. Rack suspects Leona came with the property when his dad bought it from Doran's uncle. Leona moved to wherever the family business was around the west side. Leo moved to the Doran's farm in Ross Township. It wouldn't mean anything in Florida. Uh, you know, we, we would enjoy it as well, but uh, it's part of Cincinnati history. It, it needs to be in Cincinnati. Westchester Township says it's excited to have the lion close to its roots again as the barn used to be owned by the brewing company. Moving him, though, was no easy feat. It took a lot of research to figure out the best way to get it over here safely. Um, we contacted a rigging company and our community services and parks department team really worked to help get that over. The Dorans attended the grand opening of the restored Mulhauser barn and say they knew it was the perfect place to rehouse their lion for all to enjoy. You'll always see them pulling up. And then they'll come and they'll ask for permission to sit on it. My kids obviously sat on it. And you should sit on it. If you want to sit on it, sit on it. In Westchester, Paige Barnes, Local 12 News. You can always find our stories here on YouTube, but go ahead and click subscribe to get notifications and stay in the know.